Only on Fox 28 News at 10, video from the sidelines at a youth football scrimmage where a father accused Craig Krenzel of assaulting his eight-year-old son. Now, we first told you last night about the police report filed against the former Buckeye quarterback. And tonight, Fox 28's Tara Morgan is live now with that new cell phone video. Tara? Well, Adam and Yolanda, the video does not show what Bruce Wolf told me and Dublin police, but you can see what appears to be a heated conversation. While some parents are coming to Krenzel's defense, the woman behind the video who did not want to use her name says what she witnessed was an assault. The woman who recorded this 25-second clip says she captured a heated moment between Bruce Wolf and former Buckeye star quarterback Craig Krenzel. She says right after Wolf told Krenzel to never touch his son again, Krenzel patted Wolf on the shoulder. You then hear Krenzel say this. The woman says Krenzel picked the boy up by his helmet and held him by his shoulder pads two feet off the ground. Wolf says Krenzel shook his son like a rag doll while screaming at him Monday night after Krenzel's son's helmet came off during a scuffle between the two boys. He was at the height of his emotion at that particular time and unleashed it on my son. Completely blown out of proportion. Tracy Mitchell says she was 12 feet away. He got him up off of the ground, but he got him on his feet. He was certainly not violently you know, messing around with them or tossing them around. In a witness statement to Dublin police, Coach Brian Blankenship described the assault allegations as ridiculous overkill. Blankenship wrote that Wolf's son ripped the helmet off the other player, and that's when Krenzel ran over, grabbed Wolf's son by the shoulder pads, lifted him off the ground, and told him, quote, we don't do that, then put the boy down. The scrimmage went back into play. Both boys went back into the scrimmage. Blankenship told police he didn't believe Krenzel was attempting to harm the boy. No charges have been filed. Krenzel's attorney says parents have started a petition to have him reinstated as a coach with the Dublin Football League. In Dublin, Tara Morgan, Fox 28 News. Thank you.